Welcome back guys to another All Things Nerd video. As always, my name is Nathan, and today we're gonna to be doing the ranking of all the Scream movies. So let's take a look and get right into this. Now with my ranking, <laughs> I'm gonna be hated a little bit because I'm a little bit different when it comes to the Scream movies. I have kind of a different opinion on all of them and it's just gonna be different <laughs> so don't hate me this is my opinion you know you may have your opinion i have my opinion and you're probably like well your opinion's wrong <laughs> so that's okay you know we can agree to disagree but one thing we can all agree with is number one let's put the number one spot to scream the original right scream the original scream that came out it's the OG, you know, it, it was the best movie. I mean, number one has to be that. If your number one isn't that, you're crazy, right? Now, Scream 1, it, it started it all, right? It rebooted the slasher genre. Like, the scary movies back in, what was it, 1996, they weren't doing that well. They were struggling really bad. And then Wes Craven came out with Scream with Kevin Williamson, you know, writing the script and... It rebooted everything i mean scream is the reason why we have a bunch of slashers that we have today i mean it made the slasher genre and so having the og and giving it that respect is one of the best things ever right it's it's one of the best scariest and all time movies i think you know that intro with drew barrymore being the opening kill you can't <laughs> you can't go wrong with that i mean nobody saw that twist coming you know everybody thought that her being in the movie it was going to be you know she was probably going to be the final girl right she was probably people probably thought she was going to be sydney so you know and then having the ending you know spoilers for those who have never actually seen scream one sorry if you haven't the movie's been out for like 25 years now <laughs> so go watch scream but you know having that ending with billy and Stu being the killers and there was two killers that was a big twist for back in the day so we're going to give the number one spot scream one now my second spot <laughs> don't butcher me like i said don't get mad with me here all right it's gonna go to scream three i love scream three i thought scream three was an awesome film i thought it was a lot of fun i thought that the comedy in it, the comedy in the movie was great i love seeing roman as the reveal i thought he was the best ghost face there's ever been for me personally you know he was the mastermind behind everything and then you had funny scenes in the movie and you had comedy like it was it was just a fun scream movie and a lot of people want to hate on scream 3 which i don't really understand that personally because i thought it was it's my second favorite behind the original i love scream 3 like it or hate it i'm sorry i love it it's my opinion uh i i thought i think scream 3 should get a lot more credit than it does people want to put scream 3 a lot of times last right and they want to put it even behind scream 4 and i'm like you guys are crazy scream 4 is just okay we'll get to scream 4 in a minute but yeah so scream 3 is definitely gonna be my second pick for probably the best out of all the scream movies so Number three, I'm going to give to Scream 2. Scream 2 is an amazing sequel to a movie. That's how you get a movie sequel done, right? Scream 2 was awesome. A lot of people even consider Scream 2 to be better than the original, right? You have the fan base where they're kind of split. They're like, Scream 2 is better than Scream 1. People are like, heck no, Scream 1 is better than Scream 2, right? I like Scream 3, so I know you guys are probably already done watching this video. <laughs> You're like, I don't even care what Nathan has to say anymore. Like, I'm gonna put on a ghost face costume and give him a call and ask him what his favorite scary movie is, and I'm gonna be like, Scream 3. And you're gonna be like, oh crap, like, I don't wanna call this guy anymore. <laughs> you guys wouldn't have patience for me if you were ghost face and you were calling me. You'd be like, uh, this guy's insane. You know, did he really just say his one of his favorite scary movies is Scream 3? <laughs> but anyways, let's go back to Scream 2. Scream 2 is how you get a sequel done, right? Uh, the, the the sequel to Scream 1 is like one of the best sequels of any movie there's ever been. So, you know, having Mickey and Miss Loomis be the killers and then there was two killers and you only thought there was one. It was a great reveal at the end. Now, the original script didn't have them as the killers, right? It had her, her friend. Uh, I can't think of her name right now. Top of my head, I'm losing her. And then it also had her boyfriend. 
uh, Derek, right, be the killer. So they had to rewrite it because there was a script leak on the internet, which actually came out and the internet was still new back then, but Scream 2 was leaked. And so they had to do a bunch of rewrites. So I'm gonna give number three spot to Scream 2. Now this is kind of tough because my four spot is either gonna go to Scream 2022, which is the, you know, the, the reboot of the franchise, Scream 5, or it's gonna go to Scream 4, and I'm gonna have to give it to Scream 2022. I know, I'm sorry. I like Scream 2022 way better than I did like four. Actually, hmm, I'm kind of torn <laughs> because I, there's some there's things about Scream 4 that I do love. Like I like the brutality of Ghostface in that movie, you know, with Charlie being the killer and that guy was insane with Jill. But then I like parts in Scream 2022 and then there were some things that I didn't like. So I'm kind of torn between the two, but I think I like Scream 22, 2022, Scream 5, Scream 5, whatever you want to call it. I thought it was a better movie than four. Four is definitely going to have to be my last pick. Four was a good movie, but it wasn't. I think the thing that gives it away for me was the filter. So anyways, let's talk about Scream 2022 real quick. I thought Scream 2022 was great. Um, I like the direction that Radio Silence is taking these movies. Obviously, I keep saying this. I can't wait for Scream 6 coming out. And by the way, before I continue, if you guys haven't seen, we're actually giving away two free movie tickets for Scream 6. So I will put that in the comment section below and you can check out the link there. If you haven't done the giveaway, please go enter the giveaway. We're giving away two free movie tickets. It's two free movie tickets. Like, <laughs> why don't people want movie tickets? <laughs> but anyways, go check out that link. It will have all the details. Script. I'm knocking over my mic here. It will have all the details in that video where you can enter the giveaway. So anyways, back to Scream 2022. I thought Radio Silence is going in a great direction with Scream. I can't wait for Scream 6 coming up on March 10th. I know you guys are excited just as much as I am. I thought that movie was really great. I thought the opening with Jenna Ortega was done perfectly, just like the original Scream. I thought it was awesome the way they did that. And um, the killer reveals were just okay. I... At the very beginning of the movie, it, it pretty much gives it away who the killers are, right? So I think there was a lot of flaws that Scream 2022 had. I think a lot of nostalgia got of people for this movie, right? Because of them, they did really well in the marketing. And so I thought they did a poor job on the trailer because they gave away a lot of information. I, w I was just kind of upset as the next person. It's like, why would you give all this, the killers in your trailer? like? I don't know. It just didn't make a lot of sense to me why they would go that direction. Now, with the whole twist being in Stu's house and all that, that was pretty cool. Um, I thought Amber, I knew Amber was most likely going to be a killer. You know, pretty much says it from the beginning. But Richie, I didn't really expect Richie. I want to be honest with you. I He always seemed like a red herring to me, right? He, They kind of pointed him to be a killer, but it didn't really go that direction and then boom he stabs sam and you're like oh crap you know there's a second killer so i don't know so scream 2022 is definitely gonna be four so let's talk about scream four who is my last pick for the night i'm sorry i know you guys are already lost me on scream three right <laughs> i like scream three scream four i thought is a good movie too you know don't get me wrong for me there's really no bad scream movie you know but this is definitely going to be my order that I would put them in personally. This is just my own personal opinion. That's fun. Don't ghost face call me. Uh, <laughs> you know, now let's talk about Scream 4 for a minute. One of the biggest flaws that I mentioned earlier is I didn't like the filter. And I know a lot of people didn't like the filter on the movie. I wasn't a big fan with that either. I don't know why they did that. I know there was a reasoning behind it. I just can't think of it at the top of my head. I think it has to do with they were trying to make it a a prequel right or whatever they wanted to do with the movie so there was a reasoning behind the excuse me the filter now i thought jill was a great reveal you know i didn't really see charlie coming either i, I like charlie i thought he was a great guy i thought charlie was pretty relaxed and he was just like a film nerd right just like um kirby in that movie which that was super sad seeing when kirby gets stabbed and then, you know, you have Jill, who's the reveal. And I didn't see Jill coming at all. You know, a lot of people didn't see Jill be the killer. I, I thought it could have been other people, but, you know, I thought they did a good job. So anyways, guys, let me know in the comments section below, what is your order for the Scream movies? 
and tell me how much you hate me for me putting Scream 3 second. <laughs> I'm just messing. Yeah, maybe you do. Maybe you actually hate me for putting Scream 3 second. But remember, this is just my opinion. It's all fun, guys. They're just movies. Um, but yeah, we'd love to hear from you guys. You know, what is your order for the Scream movies? I know we all can't wait for March 10th coming up for Scream 6. As I mentioned before, if you haven't, check out the giveaway. I will put it in the comment section below. As always, if you like, please like this video. If you like the video, subscribe to the channel, and I will see you guys on the next video. Take care.